Hey, how's it going guys? Welcome to a brand new YouTube video. I hope you guys are all doing great. Today guys, we're going to be talking about the potential release date for Borderlands 4. I was covering Borderlands 3 leaks in the past and I kind of wanted to keep coming back to this game franchise this game franchise i should say because i am a very big borderlands fan it's probably my second favorite franchise right behind fallout um but yeah i mean i've been playing borderlands since i was a kid necessarily um but yeah i have borderlands 1 i have borderlands 2 i have borderlands the pre-sequel and i have borderlands 3 i'm playing borderlands 3 with a friend right now and i beat res uh, i'm sorry i beat borderlands 1 game of the year edition quite a while ago and that kind of inspired me to make this video which is the potential release date for borderlands 4 now i know borderlands has been in a weird state lately since tiny tina's wonderlands is still getting updated with content now i'm not someone who wants to talk about the game because i've not played it i've heard the reviews and it's not something i really want to get into right now maybe in the near future i'll give it a shot and maybe play it but right now guys i'm gonna be focused on the main mainline games and that is borderlands borderlands has been a staple in my childhood and well i wanted to talk about it here in today's video here's everything we know about borderlands 4 potential release date borderlands 4 is possibly years away at this moment we just got tiny tina's wonderlands and also we got the announcement for Bo tales from the borderlands 2 being developed by gearbox themselves but there are some things we can talk about According to reports, Gearbox parent company wants to change release dates for games, which I mean they want to release games more frequently, more like every year, and according to a recent earnings call, they're expected to release 9 AAA games by 2026. Let's think here for a second. We just got Tiny Tina's Wonderlands, and we're expected to get Tales from the Borderlands 2 this year. And we also just got a game from Gearbox themselves called Tribes of Midgard. So that's three AAA games so far in recent years. And we don't know if that's counting, but there's also more games coming, which are those three games. Those are Homeworld 3 from Blackbird Interactive, Have a Nice Death from Magic Design Studios, and Eyes in the Dark, The Curious Case of One Victoria Bloom from Under the Stairs. Two more games are planned for release in 2023 and beyond. The first is Hyper Light Breaker from Heart Machine, and the second is Relic Hunter's Legend from Rogue Snail. That's six more games, but maybe we could be looking at this wrong. And there is meant to be more games, but there's no doubt about it. Gearbox's bread and butter is Borderlands, and they wouldn't want to walk away probably to one of the greatest looter shooters ever created, in my personal opinion. So there you guys go. I've named a couple games out so far for you. That should be a potential roadmap. So 2026, it's four years away, right? Tiny Tina's Wonderland is still being updated with content. It, I think it's currently on its third DLC. It's about to be released or I can't really speak too much. I don't know the release cycle and I don't know what's currently going on for that game. I haven't played the game. All I know is it's literally a carbon copy of Borderlands 3. I, I don't know. But that's pretty much the roadmap where we are looking at, right? And if you ask me, I think the latest we'll probably get it is 2025 at its earliest, 2024. The game's probably in its conceptual phases. It's probably getting uh, detailed at, as we speak. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. I know this video wasn't anything interesting, but this is just something that I wanted to talk about. And I hope you guys definitely did enjoy. I will be going over more history videos on Borderlands. I hope you guys can definitely stick around and will enjoy those videos. I'll be coming out with more Borderlands content in the near future. I'll have a Resident Evil video out tomorrow. Take care, guys, and enjoy.